In this video, we're going to talk about a meme coin with a Chinese theme, which could be your next 100 million to 1 billion dollar market cap blue chip meme coin. Okay, guys, you may be familiar with Pepe or Chinese Pepe, um, which started the whole Chinese meta in meme coins. This one hit 100 million recently. In fact, it hit 100 million before, it's just hit 100 million again. And uh, there's a lot of potential for this to go to a billion. It's already solidified itself as a blue chip meme coin, in my opinion, by hitting that 100 million. Okay, guys. But apart from that, there is no other Chinese meme coin that has hit 100 million. Biao or Bao King or Bao, however you pronounce this one, right? B-I-A-O. This one hit at its market peak, $53 million in market cap. And it's currently on a pullback to 18 just over 18 million in market cap and i think that this one could have some huge potential to do 100 million plus uh, that's only that's only a little bit more than 5x away from where it is at the moment right um but yeah there's there is a reason for why i believe that it can do that and um if you're not familiar with what this is so this is uh, is is the most or said to be the most famous meme in the Asian uh, market for memes? Okay, guys, we all know about Pepe, obviously, right? Pepe is like the most famous meme right now in you know, you know what what we know, right? And then you have this one. So if you're in China, basically, you probably know this already, but you know, if or if you have a Chinese background, right? But if you're someone like myself. Without being told this, you wouldn't know what this is, right? It's a panda with a man's face on it, and it's basically one of the most famous memes, or the famous meme, according to the website, right? The famous, the most famous Asian meme. Okay, guys. And as you can see, this is what we're working with here. Obviously, it's a meme coin. So remember, there is no intrinsic value. There's no utility. Please don't risk more than what you can afford to lose if you are buying something like this. Remember, it's super high risk. By the way, this is based on the Ethereum network. So this is an ERC-20 token. Obviously, we know that ERC-20 memes do attract the whales. Okay, guys. And this one is definitely attracting the whales. And that strong liquidity with a million dollars in liquidity, definitely attracting the whales with 5,000 holders where it's sitting right now at 18.3 million market cap, holding this level very well. In my opinion, if this does hold above 10 million or even 5 million or even 2 million, you know, this one has huge potential to still print you 100x from those levels, uh, potentially. Okay, guys, because, you know, from where it is right now, it's only a 5x to 100 million. Okay, um, so that will be approximately a 50x to a billion dollars, right, in market cap. Um and you know that that's that's really nothing in the scheme of things when it comes to meme coins right now because we are expecting like some super cycle in meme coins. I think we're going to see the biggest meme coin uh, explosion that we've seen in the entirety of the crypto market's existence in this bull run. I think we're going to see that. And a lot of the reasons why is that people are beginning to understand you know, that what meme coins are and understand that, you know, having, uh, you know, some exposure of your portfolio in meme coins, you know, is probably the best option at the moment in terms of, you know, maximizing your yield potential in this market because meme coins tend to outperform the rest of the market. Gaming, AI, you name it, right? Utility, DeFi, meme coins do outperform every other you know, every other market. And that's just the way it is, right? So with something like this, you know, if you look at the narrative, right? So the narrative is Chinese meme coins, okay? So Pepe is, Chinese Pepe is not an original Chinese meme, okay? But it does have, obviously, you know, that whole Pepe relationship. That's why this will do well, okay? Now, something like this, this is a Chinese original meme. Again, the most famous Asian meme, okay, guys? So, it has that narrative, uh, a strong narrative that can carry it forward. Now, me personally, right, I did actually buy this right at the beginning uh, when it launched. I think I bought this about, 
maybe between 800 and a million dollars in market cap or a little a little bit more than that right i can't remember exactly where i bought it but unfortunately i cheated this token right i sold it way too early I, I i did take some profit i did i made a profit so you can't complain like a profit is a profit right but had i held this token i could have made up to 40 50x okay at the top and the reason that why i sold it is because you know there was i've seen this token come up in the past or right? i've seen other versions of this token right and i didn't not fully understand what this was and i didn't fully uh I guess I didn't fully have conviction in, you know, the, the Chinese narrative, I guess, okay? Because there's other ones that I bought as well, like Chinese Brit and Chinese, uh, you know, Andy on Solana and things like that, which, and it didn't do well. This, unfortunately, well, unfortunately for me, but fortunately for others, right? But this did do well. And, you know, I missed out on some huge gains on this token. But that being said, it's on a pullback right now, and I'm considering. But I'm considering. I'm not holding this token at the moment, but I'm considering buying into it uh, because of the narrative and because it's it's, it's proving itself as a strong contender uh, contender for the Chinese meme coins in that narrative. Okay, guys. Not only that, but the team behind this seem to be a good team. Now you see a lot of these kinds of tokens mean coins especially nowadays right especially over on solana you've seen a lot of community takeovers right uh the team will launch a token or the dev will launch a token and they will sell the token they'll get out right and then the community will take over the token and try and run it up but what you'll find a downside to that is they don't have a you know a a strong team that's committed a lot of the time right they don't have a marketing budget so what they do is they create a marketing wallet and they rely on the community to uh they rely on like the community to send uh coins to uh to send uh funds to the wallet for marketing okay guys now this is not a community takeover they have a strong team that's marketing it this is actually a sponsored video they did reach out to me but as i said i'm familiar with the token i did buy it before so i know that it's, it's got potential okay i saw something in it before Unfortunately, I didn't hold it long enough, right? But um, it, it seems to have a strong team behind it and a strong marketing budget. And they've grown this community to like 10K on Twitter. Now, when I've, again, when I first came across this token, it didn't have all these followers, right? It didn't have, you know, all these people that I'm following, following it now. It was brand new. So I didn't have these metrics to decide as to whether this was a good token with staying power before. But now I know that it is. All right, all right. Or at least I see the potential that it can be, right? And they are continuously posting memes, all right? They haven't abandoned the project. They're here all day, every day, posting memes every single, well, maybe not every single hour, but every few hours, you know, they are posting memes. So they have an active Twitter account. Um, they have an active, strong community, okay, guys? And it's got, it's a great meme with a great narrative. So, and, and they are doing marketing. So with all of those things, all of that information gathered together, right? It makes me see that there is strong potential in this particular token, especially on a pullback. There's going to be a lot of people looking at this, especially if it comes lower. Okay. If it comes lower, there's a support, uh, strong support over here around 10 million. So if this comes lower to about 10 million, that will be an optimal buying point for this particular token. It's not financial advice. Okay, guys, but if you were looking at a DCA strategy for this particular token, you're not buying the top. You're not buying the top right now. So I think that this one has potential. It's continuously trending, right? It's hot number nine on Dex Tools at the moment. Okay, I don't pay attention to audits on meme coins anyway. All I want to know is that the dev is not going to dump. Okay, guys, and um, ultimately, when it comes to a team running a project, there's going to be some control of the supply okay so when it comes to distribution i don't pay much attention to it right on a community takeover i pay more attention but on something that has a strong team that's pushing the token right i think the more if they control a lot of the supply in my opinion that's a good thing okay that's a good thing because that is what's going to make the price go up in my opinion right it's, you may call it price manipulation or whatever right but in my opinion you know is 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 not a utility token. It's not a DeFi token. 
or anything like that, right? It's a meme coin, okay? So it's a meme coin, okay? So if it's got something going for it, it's got something going for it. And if the team are willing to hold and continue to push the token, then, you know, sky's the limit in terms of potential. All you have to do is look at something like Dogecoin or Shiba Inu or Pepe or Dog With Hat to know that, yo, there's potential here. Okay, guys, there's potential with a meme coin. All right, guys? So, yeah, I mean, there are other Chinese meme coins. You're going to see other Chinese meme coins, things like this, right? This one's trending number one right now. This is a very low market cap, okay? Super high risk, super high risk, okay, guys? Looks nothing like the bullishness of the chart for this particular meme coin. And so in terms of the Chinese meme coins, in my opinion, there's only two that are really looking good right now, and that is the Chinese Pepe, and obviously the runner up to that, the beta play on Chinese Pepe at the moment would be Biao. So ultimately, the narrative is there, and this one is an original meme, okay? Pepe, again, Pepe is obviously riding off the whole Pepe narrative, the Chinese Pepe is not an original meme, um, or it's not the original Pepe, okay? But this is the original Biao or Bao or ba Bao King, okay? How have you pronounced that? But um, yeah, that's really all I've got for you in this video. Um, let me know what you think in the comments. I do see massive potential for this meme, but again, it's not financial advice. Do your own research. Don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. Guys, let me know what you think in the comments and I'll see you in the next video. Crypto lifesaver, all Solana flipping memes. Crypto lifesaver, he be farming with OPs. Crypto lifesaver, every day he got them plays. Oh, crypto lifesaver, yeah, crypto life. Oh, blockchain, blockchain, blockchain. Yeah, walk on nowhere three. I'm a DJ in the game and I don't even sleep. Got a preset on Solana, I'm a eight. It's a meme. A hundred X or thousand X, regardless, I'm a G.